Crews at Fukushima Daiichi worked through the night, fixing a problem that could have had dangerous consequences. The system's cooling spent fuel rods and four pools at the plant stopped working. Tokyo Electric Power Company engineers say the systems are running again. A blackout occurred at the facility on Monday night. For a short while, workers inside the plant's accident response center were left in the dark. TEPCO engineers noticed the systems that cooled the spent fuel rods had stopped working. The pools are connected to reactors 1, 3, and 4, along with another pool. The pools contain about 8,500 8, units of spent fuel rods. TEPCO needs to keep cooling water flowing into them or temperatures will rise. If it gets too hot, fuel can melt down and release a massive amount of radiation. Engineers trace the problem to three high-voltage switchboards. They say they've bypassed these devices and reactivated the electricity. They say they've managed to get the cooling systems for all four pools operating again. The engineers say they still have not figured out what caused the malfunction. TEPCO spokespersons say radiation levels around Fukushima Daiichi have not changed. And they say the mechanism that cools the melted fuel in the reactors has not been affected.